Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. All right, where we left off, we were in the middle, well, more like at the beginning, of trying to find out what the hell happened down here, and apparently I'm looking at a Death Lord down there. Great. Okay, well, uh, this is our little investment that we put into that one barrow that was covered in sand. And now, apparently, we've awakened some droggers, or at least the uh, people the guy hired have uh, awakened some droggers. And now things are going far south. Very far south. Well, at least we know what's going on. Oh, great. Come on. And can we just kill this guy real quick? Oh, come on. There we go. Come on. Die already. Come on. There we go, let's kill that guy anyway. And down that one goes. What the? Oh. Oh, there's more. Great. Okay. Whoops, well, I didn't mean to hit them. <laughs> but, uh... Okay. Down you go. Whoop, I didn't mean to hit that one, but that one works too. There we go. We got one more. And down you go. Anyone else? Anyone else? No, we're good. Uh, we got apparently three dead miners here. Then uh, I realized that phrasing was a little off. The skull. Is that what? Yes, it was. The skull was what kept it from uh, being a dead end. And that... That looks like it was already covered in blood. Or maybe that's... Hmm. Huh. That is a weird texture on a skull I don't remember seeing before. You're not gonna need this. Sorry. <laughs> but you're not. Alright, and I'm gonna take whatever you have. That garnet and whatnot. And this guy... Uh, gold. There we go. Yep, all of them have, you know, nothing really worthwhile, but you might as well pick up the gold. Ooh! Said petty soul gems, greater soul gems. Those are always good to pick up. Uh huh. Let's look around, see what else we may have possibly missed. Uh, nothing as far as I can see. Uh, we got a helmet here. A hide helmet. It's weird to be down here. It's still intact. But uh, anyway, yeah. Let's head back to this guy. What do we got? Uh, ebony sword. That is very much worth it. And this Draugr had what looks to be... Yeah, he took an arrow on the back of the head. <laughs> Probably from one of his buddies that was a little too over eager. I'm going to take whatever's in here. I thought there was another one. Hey, an adept one. Let's see if we can get this open. Alrighty. Cool beans. I'm going to take that. Uh, that, not so much. Maybe on my way out if I'm still hurting a little bit. What do we got here? Ooh. I'm just going to take these relics here. These boots of water walking. Cool beans. And they, it still needs some clearing out, but then again, they didn't realize that this was an entrance in the first place. So let's look at what we got here. Those, oh, water walking. If you wear any four relics of Azadol, I believe that's how you pronounce that, Azadol, uh, plus ten enchanting. Huh. So I need all four, or do I need just one? Huh. It's weirdly phrased. It makes it hard to figure that out. Anyway, we will definitely be doing that. All right. Cool beans. Get ourselves the hell out of here and convince him to continue on. Probably with more gold, but we'll convince him nonetheless. Probably. There we go. Oh, I was really close to that door. What the hell? It's like a little dollhouse. 
Thirsk Mead Hall was founded by Hrothmund, who originally left the skull in order to live the lifestyle of ancient Nord warriors in the wilderness. Well, I have a feeling that, uh, they failed. <laughs> and that's a semi-educated guess. Alrighty. Gotta love the coffee, man. Gotta love the coffee. Maybe if they decided to sponsor me, I'd actually tell you the name. <laughs> All right, Rallis. Any luck? Yeah, a lot more luck than you'd had. That's for damn sure. I dealt with a drugger and found a way past the dead end. Well, perhaps there's some hope for us yet. Two thousand. Now, okay. I have to go recruit some more miners. It won't be easy, seeing as. None of their friends came back from the first attempt. I'll leave you to clean the bodies up. We'll have up. to sweeten the pot a bit this time. I think I'll need, say, 2,000 septums to hire replacements. <sighs> Fine. I never get tired of that sound. I'm sure you don't. It'll take me a few days to dig up some more laborers, but swing back when you get a chance. See how we're doing. Fair enough, will do, eventually. All right, we got all that taken care of and hopefully we'll see something come out of it in the near future. Well, other than the relic we just found. Anyway, I kinda don't wanna kill any more of them. They seem rather peaceful and I don't, I, I just, I kind of went with the flow with the last one, and I kind of don't want to do any more of them. Because, you know, they look rather peaceful, and apparently they're rather strong too. So, you know, I just, I just rather leave them alone. If I can, you know, avoid the murder, then I might as well. Alright, so far so good. What do we got here? Ash yams! Huh. I might as well pick these up. What the hell? In there. What the hell are you talking about? Deep. In deep? I know things. Hidden things. Things you aren't supposed to know. Really? Slow down there. What are you talking about? You don't believe me. No one does. They don't want to. I don't want to either. But I can't help it. They're in my head. Are you alright? No. That's what I'm trying to say. The secrets. They're in there. In there deep. I can't get them out. They're in my head. Okay. What kind of secrets? Uh, the secret kind. Very specific. Thank you ever so much. Where did you learn these secrets? The black book. It shoved them in there with black, slick fingers. Ooh. My fingers are too short. Okay. I can't get them out. Uh, where did you find this black book? Oh no, I didn't find it. It found me. Here, I'll show you. See? Right there. Okay. But don't go there. You don't want these things in your head. You don't. I'm pretty sure I you can don't. handle it more than Never what should the... have come here. What the... <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Dude, I didn't want to kill you. Dude. Why did you force me to do that? Scribbles of a madman, okay? Uh, black slimy fingers, black slimy words, black slimy book, white ridge, barrow, black like the back of my eyes, but darker. Get these things out of my head. Okay, then. I might as well hold on to that. White ridge, black... Blood skull barrow. I assume... Barrow he's talking about is somewhere over here. No, I'm not seeing it anywhere. White Ridge. That's Hackneer's Shoal. It's definitely not a thing we're looking for. Huh. Alrighty then. That was a thing, to say the least. The hell is this? Is this Ashen Creek Vine? Or something like that? Creek Cluster. Ash Creek Cluster. Yep, I was not wrong. Surprisingly, I was not wrong. Alright, let's keep 
going on ahead this way, because that's where we're supposed to be going. I have no idea what's up here. Might as well check it out, find out what it is. Maybe it's something interesting. Maybe it's not. I might as well pick up more of these, because they're right in my way. So, might as well. What do we got here? Well, we're coming in from a better angle than most, that's for sure. Okay. What do we got? Apparently, it's not showing shit. High point tower. How? What the? Oh. There's something down here. Uh. Nope. Oh, geez. Okay. Okay, well, this works out a little better. Okay. And that guy's sitting right down there. Let's see what we get out of this. That's some good stuff. I might want to pick up that, too. Okay. And... There we go. Got some good damage out of that. And down he goes. Let me get the ad pile. Ooh, nice. I'm loving this. All the shit I'm getting out of this. But this is not really a tower, per se. It's somewhat encased in, like, rock. So it's not really a tower. At least I wouldn't say it's a tower. Yeah, it is completely encased in fucking ash. Inside and out, looks like. So, it's not really a tower. Unless, there's something about it that I can actually get into. It's hard to tell, though. Anyway, let's just continue on with the way we're supposed to be going. I think it's, yeah, it's a little more this way. A little more easterly ways. Just, uh, you know, constantly on the lookout to make sure I'm not being ambushed. But that's far... Whoa. What the? Burnt Spriggan. Okay, this is the first one I've seen that's actually flame. Okay. Down it goes. Huh. Man. Burnt Spriggan wood. Oh, that's actually an alchemical ingredient. Okay. Man, that is tragic. Considering these usually exist just to protect the forest, and then the entire forest is burnt, so they end up horrifically disfigured like the forest they protect. Ah, oh, man, that is... Ah, oh, that is tragic. Oh, man. I feel so bad for them. I might as well figure out what this little cabin is. Probably burnt to shit. Yeah, it looks like it. Looks like it. Uh, uh, yeah, come on. I, I looked at my recording playback for a second. Okay. Alright, uh, nothing really special that I can tell. Just a ramshackle shack. Whoa, oh. A note. Meet me here at midnight. An ebony arrow. Okay. Well. I, uh. Guess I'm going to wait here for a little bit. Let's do it like a hour, or like 45 minutes short of midnight. I kind of want to see what this is about, because I've never seen this. I've legitimately never seen this. I'm going to drink my coffee, there we go, and... What the... That was a noise. Ooh, there's a lockbox over here. Uh, okay. What do we got here? Ah, fuck. Okay, that's not gonna work. That's definitely not gonna work. Maybe we do it this way. Ah, yep. Close, but no cigar. Fuck. That's not working either. Uh, ah, jump, but it. There we go. Perfect. 
Good shit. Alright. Let's get our stuff. Which is a whole bunch of it. Yeah, hello. And... Let's see. Nothing and no one's come up yet other than that. So, uh... Huh. That might have been an entire fluke. Maybe. Well, then again, it's also... What was that? Excuse me? Okay. Well, <laughs> I guess I'm going to be waiting here for a minute or two. Real life minutes, anyway. Okay. Should I have my sword out? I don't think I should. I don't think it's necessary. At the same time, I'm starting to think... Maybe I shouldn't be here. Maybe that message wasn't for me. But then again, I've been wrong before. Uh, can I sit in that chair? I could. But I kinda just want to sit here. Because it's almost time. This is the first time I've ever seen this, and I want to see what actually goes on. If it's a fluke or not. What do we got? Anything? Other than that weird tapping? It's 11.56, so almost midnight. Hmm. Seems like nothing's happening. Well, that's upsetting. I went through all that time to check on nothing. Unless something is going to happen and I'm just too impatient. That's entirely possible. Well, it's 1207 now. If something was going to happen, it would happen now. I would think. Huh. Anything? Anything at all? Huh. Not a damn clue. That sucks. It's just... I just did all of this. Even did the waiting and everything. Well... I think that was my footsteps, but... Uh, <laughs> I want to make sure that I'm not missing anything, because this is kind of cool. At least this is cool enough that I kind of want to know about it. What? Is that thing moving? That marker's moving. What the hell? What is... Oh, it was that guy. Okay. That's why that's moving. Okay. Fair enough. Thought I was losing my damn mind. Okay. Nothing happened. I'm just going to read it and take it. Maybe that'll prompt something. Nope. Nothing. It's empty ramshackle shack. And nothing else is going to pop up, apparently. Well, that sucks. After I'm done recording, I'll look this up, see what's supposed to happen. But I have no idea what's going on. Uh, anyway, I'm going to head over this way a bit. It looks like there's some sort of flame something going on. What the hell? What in the hell? Thumbs on fire. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, jeez. Nice wizard, huh? Okay. Uh, go ahead and pop that. Pop that. And don't need the chitlin plate. But ice wizard, I should probably deal with. 
Oh! Your head's gone. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> You're dead. I'll uh, take that. I'll take that. And that's it. That, that was something. I assume that this... Yeah, this was a fire wizard. I assume was attacked by that uh, ash hopper. And uh, apparently that was it. That did her in. Uh, take that. Or him in, rather. Yeah, it was a him. Okay. It was hard to tell at that angle. Okay. That was weird. Uh, yeah, that was the one I just killed. Alright. Well, we've made some decent progress towards uh, things we're supposed to get to. Oh, here we are actually at the thing. So you at the little fortress. Uh, what is... What are you... Oh, you guys are Reavers, huh? Okay, I should take care of you guys real quickly. There we go. Anyway, I think I'm going to end the episode here for right now because uh, there's nothing else really going to... Whoa, that was... The animation kind of screwed up. There's nothing really I could do around here. So uh, I'm just going to open this up and end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment. <laughs> Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and trying to open lockboxes and succeeding for you.